So playing music. Uh, you've got the notes, you've got your fingers to work on the scale, okay, but now we actually have to play music. And while this is the pitch, we have to add the rhythm. When you think about it, uh, there's that beat. We tap our feet to it all the time, but where does that beat come from, and how would you describe it? Well, let me do that for you, okay? The beat is a steady, repetitive pulse. And when you think of pulse, you think of your own heartbeat, right? Because that's where it really comes from, your heartbeat. Think way back, I don't know, a million years ago. They had music, right? They had drums and, and certainly they could sing, um, but there was nothing in, in nature to give it that sense of the pulse, that beat. So I think it comes from the heartbeat. Now, nowadays we have a metronome and you know, that thing will give you a click. Um, but that's just a click, it doesn't organize it. Now when you look at the page, you're gonna see a couple of things. You're gonna see that, that fraction looking thing, that four, four, what does that mean? The four, the top number, is gonna tell you how many beats per measure. That's how, what you're gonna to count to. The bottom number is a little bit more confusing, but for right now, just know that that bottom number just means that the quarter note is gonna get one beat, okay? So if we have a measure full of, of four quarters, it would go something like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So each note gets one beat. It lasts that long. And we should be counting out loud, okay? Something you're gonna hear me do uh, throughout all these videos. The next we have half notes, okay? These are two beats long. So we're, it's gonna count for one, two, and you want it to ring out for those two beats. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. The last rhythm that we have for now is the whole note that lasts for four beats. It's pretty simple, really. You just hit it once and let it ring. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, you should probably try this with a metronome. Let me get mine. So here I have my metronome. I've set it to 50, okay? And basically, if we count along with it, one, two, three, four, Essentially, you're just going to put a note on each one of those clicks, and you want to synchronize with it. Not too fast, not too slow. So here it goes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. It's pretty simple. So if you play your scale just with that click, it's a great way to practice up and down, just playing one note per click.